Hey, what's going on guys? Real quick, I just want to break down a little bit of what I eat in a typical day. So I'm not going to take you through a full day, but I'm going to show you a little bit about what I've been doing in the sense of keeping it simple, but trying to get as many calories as I can as fast as I can. Starting with chicken breast. Oh, I got three chicken breasts there. I'm not sure if I'm going to have to eat them all. Usually I cut them down the middle, cook them, bake them, whatever I need be, and then measure them out before I eat them just to keep how many ounces I'm getting to keep it as strict as possible. Today I'm just going to run the uh, farfalle for barilla. Bur I'm just going to run the pasta. Basically, I just throw all of that in the stove top, cook it. Boom, it's done, throw it all into a big container, throw the chicken in there as well, and that's how I keep everything super simple. It's like 1,600 calories for the whole thing, and I'm eating like 3,000, 3,500, 4,000, depending on how much I'm training that day. So 1,600 is nothing, and obviously you gotta get the carbs to get the size. So for starters, we're just gonna cut this chicken up. Boom, done, probably rinse these off. Boom, done. Basically just rinse them off a little bit, clean them up, so I get that like chicken jelly off it, whatever it is. So usually, you know, just a little bit of salt and pepper, keep it nice and simple. Today I got some different style sauce on here, sauce with whatever this is. Start off with the old garlic sriracha. Do a little bit of applewood rub as well. And I'll probably eat all these, to, eh, I might not eat them all day, but I'll probably eat them all in the next couple days. But I found this like perfect way to, <coughs> I found like the perfect way to cook these things and keep them to last longer. It's like 20 minutes at 400 to take these small fillets, I think. I'm gonna try it. Pretty sure it is though, or maybe 25, but perfect. It keeps them like nice and juicy for, I mean, I've been like three and four days, honestly. But I try to eat them as quick as possible because I technically don't really like to eat food when it's sitting in the fridge for so long. Honestly, on my own time, I like to make like really cool recipes, try something new, but with how much food I can eat now, especially since I'm in bulking, trying to put on some size, I literally, I make this whole dinner, this beautiful meal, like for two or three, four people, and I just eat it all. It's like, it's not even worth it anymore. So now I'm just getting back to the basics. I'm keeping it as simple as possible. Boom. Chicken's done. Easiest way to cook chicken, just throw it in the oven and bake it, and you can do whatever the hell you want while it's waiting. So now that that's done, I'm throwing the noodles on the stove top. I'm gonna cook those real quick. I'm gonna start putting everything else together. Noodles are cooking. So super simple, just throwing them in there. I don't even put any like salt or anything in there, which I could. I just eat them plain like at this point it's just like all about getting enough calories in me so it's time to eat though i gotta eat a little bit of something before you know that's finishes it's 12 o'clock and i'm starving so let's get to that boom really this simple i just it's really this simple i just throw it on there track it get the calories down throw it on top of uh whatever i'm gonna do a full sandwich right now Ooh, a little hoagie roll with some onions some peppers Throw that on there. Throw a little hot sauce on there as well. You know, really start feeling good. It's a ticket. It's like I'm back to my sandwich making days. Look at this puppy. Mmm. All right. Noodles are done. This is honestly the easiest way to get the max amount of calories, get all the carbs you need. Like, I was doing white rice, but I just wanted a break from it. So this is literally what I've been eating. Like, it's funny because I've just been switching between different noodles. Like, I just wanted to try the bow ties today. I have, like, lasagna for some reason. Like thin spaghetti, uh, penny pennies, like whatever those things are called. So I just like to switch it up. It just makes it more fun, I guess. Just to keep everything simple, I like to put it all in one big meal prep container. Quick taste test. Mmm, plain as can be, baby. It's the way we like it. All right, so what we just ate, all the noodles, we're sitting about 2,000 calories. So now I'm going to measure out some chicken, put some in there as well, kind of see what it gets us to. In the end, I'm trying to get about two. 50-ish grams of protein. I'm up my protein intake a little bit just to kind of see if it has any like changes in the body. You know, I like to kind of experiment with new things. So let's measure that stuff out. All right. So we're looking at 2,500 calories with what I ate for you know my first meal of the day, which is that sandwich, plus all this food right here. It's only 2,500 calories. To me, it's insane that if you try to eat healthy and eat cleaner foods, like you're not going to get nearly as much calories if you eat this junk food. But for the purpose of you know wanting to do this as clean as possible, this bulk is. I'm eating this healthy food. I'm trying to, you know, show you guys exactly what I'm doing all the time, so you guys kind of know, you know, you're not seeing anything. I'm not doing anything secretive or anything like that. So the bulk is, you know, 100% on the table to see what you guys have to do, or what I had to do to get to where I want to be. Of course, we're all different. Everybody's body's different. Everybody reacts differently to each thing. But if you see it from someone who's also a natural lifter, if you're a natural lifter, you know, from my point of view of how I'm doing this and what I have to do to get to where I want to be, and it works for you, hey, great. So. Just want to show you guys a little bit of what I've been doing for eating almost every day. This is like basically what my meals look like for the past three weeks. So it's just a big tub. It's a bunch of 
you know, carbs, a bunch of protein, and then obviously I get my fats from some nuts, some peanut butter, like anything like that, avocados as well. So, thanks for watching, guys. Just a quick video for you guys to see what I've been doing, what I've been up to. Like and subscribe.